In this video, we're going to show you how to remove the rear wiper arm and motor from a Tiguan Mark II, that's years 2017 onwards. Tools you'll need for the job, a ratchet with a 13mm socket and a 10mm socket, a trim removal tool and a T20 Torx. So first of all, we're going to remove the rear wiper arm, pop the little cap up and take that off. And underneath there, there's a 13mm not to undo. These can be quite stiff to get off, especially if they've been on for a while. So just pull the arm up and just wiggle it back and forth. Don't put too much pressure on it, you break it and that should go. Sometimes you might have to use a puller if it is really stuck on. So we need to remove this inner boot trim panel. So first we'll remove the warning triangle, just pop out of its holder. And there's three T20 torques to undo. There's one here, one there, and one on the handle section, just down in there. So undo those three and remove them. And there's also T two T20 torques behind this handle here. So using a trim tool, you've got to get the face plate off first. Just find a gap on one end and just pry it down. They are quite tight. So the clips will go and that pulls out straight towards you. And quite hard to see, but there is two T20 torques just up there. Undo both of those. We need to remove the inner boot trim, we've got to take it off in stages so you need to do the top trim first, then the sides, then the main trim. So first this one, just get behind it with a trim tool, pop it out on one side and then work your way along. And then the side trim, same thing. There's no fittings, you've just got to pop it off. So there's one there and then two up the side. And it'll be the same on the other side. And now the main trim. So we're going to take these rear light covers out just to give us a bit of leverage on the inside if we need it. And then starting where the handle was, you can make a bit of a gap there because it's loose. Get your trim tool in, and you've just got to work your way around, popping the clips off. And there's two there on the inside, so you can use that for a bit of leverage. And then working your way along. the trim removed. Now we've got access to the back of the motor, undo the electrics first, there's just a tab that pushes in on the connector and that pulls away. And then there's three 10mm nuts to undo. When you've undone the last nut, that just pulls out straight towards you and that's the motor removed.